Four, the new head hog is in Fayetteville. Five News was at Drake Field as new Razorback head coach John Calipari arrived this afternoon ahead of his first public appearance later tonight. Thanks for joining us at four. I'm Darren Bob. And I'm Alexandra Burnley. It's felt like a lifetime for Hog fans after ESPN said Coach Cal was in talks to join the Hogs on Sunday night to 9 o'clock this morning when the deal was finally signed. The whole five new sports team has been following these developments from the very beginning. We'll have all three of them live tonight with more on the move and how Razorback fans are reacting to all of this. So let's kick it off with sports director Alex Stewart and weekend anchor Robin Hearn with more on Kelly Perry's winning background. Hi, guys. Well, Coach Muss may have left for Cali, but Hunter Juracek won up that and brought Cali to Arkansas. That is right, official this morning, John Calipari, the 14th head coach for the men's basketball program here at the University of Arkansas. And what a hire it is. They get a Hall of Famer now yelling from the sidelines. I would imagine he's probably going to keep that same Muss energy up as yeah. we saw for all of, what, five years here with Coach yep. Muss. But he joins as the 12th winningest coach in Division I basketball history, 808 official wins on his record. He's been to four Final Fours, and he won a national championship in 2012, Robin. A lot of excitement here. It might be raining, as you saw behind us, but there is no raining on the Cala party today. It is in <laughs> full force. Oh, yeah. Very exciting for the Razorbacks. Not so much for the Wildcats, but we don't really care because the Razorbacks are feeling it. But I know that Tyson sent some Dino Nuggets to some Kentucky radio stations just yep. kind of like feeling this little rivalry now. Now Calipari's on this side of things. Oh yeah, I know it was a fierce rivalry before, yes. but it is only going to get upped. And you know what? The fans here, they're playing a big part in that. Oh, yeah. A big part in the rivalry. And we actually have Parker Abels. He spoke to some of the fans earlier today. If we can bring him on in here. Parker, you talked to some of the fans today. What was kind of the reaction around campus? I mean, they are beyond excited to have Coach Cal here coaching in that building right there. And they actually think that this hire is going to take this program to a whole nother level. The lowest of lows last week to like the highest of highs this week. Very excited. Um, not only that he's going to be our coach, he just elevated the Arkansas brand to a spot it's never been before. I was nervous when we lost Coach Muss. I was really worried about it, but him coming here, I mean, Riding up my week for sure. I mean, if you told me that a week ago, I'd have told you you were lying. I feel like he's really going to uh, bring some new guys in here and uh, really uh, bring a new culture to the program and really raise us up. And I think uh, hopefully uh, we make some good tournament runs here in the future. Yeah, and Alex, they are especially excited to see Calipari in this building tonight for the first time in Cardinal Red. You know, the thing, Parker, is that it's going to be really interesting, though, because as he comes here to Arkansas, he inherits, I can't even say he inherits a basketball team. They have nobody on the active roster, and they have no incoming freshmen. So he is literally starting with nothing. So we're going to see this team built in his image from day one, which could have big repercussions for how long he keeps this job. And to see how long he keeps this job, whether it goes well or poorly, we have our Kayla back in studio to break down the contract he signed earlier today. Kayla? Yeah, guys, we're super excited to have Calipari here with the Razorbacks. The former University of Kentucky head basketball coach has already agreed on terms as the new Razorback basketball head coach. While he did sign on to slightly less than his previous contract at Kentucky, totaling at around $8 million per year, Calipari will be the highest paid basketball coach in Razorback history. According to Calipari's five-year contract, he will make roughly $7 million a year. That includes a $500,000 annual salary with an additional six and a half million every year towards performance for speaking engagements, television and radio appearances, sponsorships, and any other media related obligations. Calipari will receive a $1 million signing bonus. Additionally, he will receive payment increases every time the team reaches certain goals. For example, an additional $50,000 of the team goes to the NCAA tournament all the way up to $500,000 if they win the championship. The contract is valid for two automatic rollover years if the team does make NCAA tournament appearances, possibly extending that contract to 2031. 
Benefits include 10 tickets to each home basketball game and five tickets to any Razorback home game of any sport. He'll also be loaned two cars that he will have to pay expenses to maintain, operate, and insure. Ahead of the announcement of Calipari's arrival, the U of A Board of Trustees approved a resolution to increase his maximum salary. The funds for these payments will come from private funds and non-taxpayer self-generated money from sponsorship deals. Kayla Davis, 5 News. All right, Kayla, thanks. Of course, we'll have full coverage here uh, tonight, uh, tonight as the university introduces Coach Cal at 5 and at 6. Then tonight on your 5 News at 6, we'll bring you the full introduction and press conference inside Bud Walton Arena. We'll also be live streaming that event on our website as well as on all of our social media accounts. Let's go ahead and